boo. Yeah. I'm scary, aren't I? <laughs> no, I'm not. No, just, just, just roll the intro. Hello, everybody. It is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to the Sith Inquisitor, episode 15, I believe. I've just found out something. All the flashpoints are required to do one of the objectives. So, every single flashpoint is actually part of the Dark vs. Light event. Oh my god, well, I, well, okay, every single flashpoint, you know, every single flashpoint that matters to the story. Uh, so, I've been doing a little bit of achievement hunting for the Dark vs. Light event, done the Rackle stuff, um, as you can see there. Um, I did that ages ago, did that ages ago. I have tried to do a little bit of Warzone stuff, a little bit. Um, I'm rank 3 in terms of Valor. I got to like rank 3 and I'm like, oh, I can't be bothered to do any more PvP because we lost twice in a row. Um, so yeah, and I uh, there was there's like one to do um, Warzones 15 times. Where is it? There it is. And I've done 2 out of 15 and like I said, we lost like twice. So I couldn't be bothered. Anyway, we're going to do boarding party and the foundry like I said we were gonna do this week and no right because it's a smuggler who's gonna finish his chapter one story this week not that you guys watch it but oh well but first we need to speak to this droid identification verified Moff, Fenia and Darth Malgus waiting to begin okay carry on oh okay fine let's get straight to the point new arrivals proceed to Moff Fenier Moff Fenier where are you, Muffinier? There you are, Muffinier! Tell the Red Shrike to hold position until they're patched. They're not doing us any good. Ah, oh, yes, I know, sir. patching, it's a nightmare. Get those engineers a shuttle. Muffinier? <laughs> Darth Malgus sent me. <laughs> Actually called Finier. Lord, it's an honor to commit myself and my fleet to your cause. The Sith shall lead us to glory in the Emperor's name. Don't bother with nice to see his Muffinier. I came for a briefing, not your pledge of support. Tell Darth Malgus we're ready. This is Darth Malgus to the Imperial Strike Force. The Emperor's prisoner, the escaped Jedi Master, has unwittingly led us to the Nanthri system. That is the location of the Foundry, an ancient alien space station embedded inside an asteroid. The full capabilities of the Foundry remain a mystery, but the Jedi Master who discovered it will do anything to protect it. The Republic fleet is already on guard. I will destroy the enemies of the Empire. We are en route to intercept a Republic cruiser carrying supplies and reinforcements to the Foundry. We will immobilize the cruiser with a tractor beam. You shall lead the boarding party. Once the cruiser is captured, you can use it to slip past the Republic defenses and infiltrate the Foundry itself. Time for you to see what a Sith can do. Once you have the cruiser and begin your attack on the Foundry, we will engage the Republic directly. You must not underestimate the Republic defenses or the Foundry's Jedi Master. He is the greatest threat, but your will is stronger. Plan on telling me who this Jedi Master is? No, no, you're not going to tell me. You're going to leave that big surprise. Cruiser. Attempting to lock tractor beams. We have them. Get to the airlock and take that ship. It's the only way we can reach the foundry. I mean, if you watched my smuggler episodes last week then you'll know who this Jedi is. Uh, if you didn't, and you've never ever done boarding party or the foundry, I'm gonna leave it a surprise for you. Though it should be pretty obvious who it is. JUMP! Wait, the group leader must be... What? Okay, that was bizarre. I mean, I did try and go into a uh, hammer station earlier. But why would this affect boarding party? Because I thought, oh, I'll do all the, I'll do all the, the flashpoints because they're all in solo mode. Well, well, no, only the ones that matter are in solo mode. Um, I think anyway. So, hello, Jesus Droid, how are you? Stand you right? Of life okay. There's a full battalion aboard, along with a team of Jedi Knights. Be cautious. I'm always cautious. Don't you know me at all? Well, you don't actually. You've only heard things about me and that's it. Open up! Knock knock! Go. 
Go! Go! Hello! Say goodbye to your life, Republic Riflemans. Ooh, a bonus mission. Do I bother? Uh, <coughs> oh, whoa! Um, sorry about that. I don't know why I have a bit of a cough. Although it might have something to do with... Uh, I think I swallowed a fly before I started recording this episode. Something flew into my mouth and I breathed it in. So... <laughs> Yeah, that's uh, not pleasant. I think the answer will be no, we won't do the bonus mission because it's not really needed. Um, I'm level 33 now. I did a little bit of leveling up uh, due to doing the Rackle stuff um, and a bit of PvP. Um, I need an experience boost. Don't have an experience boost. I mean, I got cartel coins. I could buy one. But Charlie, why don't you just go into your stronghold to go get one? Well, can't be bothered. Wait, can't be combined with any. Oh! Bloody. <sighs> it always annoyed me that if you've got an experience boost up, you can't get rid of it until the timer runs out. That is, I mean, I, I get the point in it because some people accidentally click it off it. And, you know, if you accidentally click it off, you've lost it. But, I, 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 I wanna... Uh. So yeah, with these achievements on the plus side, when I said last time that I would have done the, uh, the achievements with the smuggler, which I did, I did do the, um, Maelstrom Prison and the, uh, What's the other one? Terrell 5 achievements, or the vice versa one. At least it still counts towards these achievements, so hooray. Bye. Oh, it only knocked you down and that's it. Oh, how pointless is that? Andronicos, could you do me a favor and not go... Oh, you're, you're there. Jesus, Droid, could you do me a favor and not go so far away from me? I hate having to go all the way around this room just to kill my enemy. Oh, gotta love this. And goodbye. You are the weakest link. Goodbye. Oh no, they've been boarded. Should I think about it? I probably could have done the com link disruption bonus mission. Because, uh. Well, I've, I've kind of killed all the enemies in my way at the moment. Only because they've been mandatory. More mandatory than they were on 2 out of 5 on the smuggler. So, yeah. That's a very uncomfortable place for you to be standing. Should you really be standing there? If you give me, if you leave, give me a minute, I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna go back and get that theme because I'm probably gonna be able to do it on the way to my objective. The Staria has called for. Oh, are you actually gonna be following me? No. Oh, okay. Well, they're they're already dead. So, th th thanks. Thank, thank you. I, I think Jedi veteran, eh? Thanks for your many years of service. Not really, because I'm part of the Sith. Also, aren't veterans meant to be decommissioned? Wait, where the hell am I? Oh, I'm in this like little corner bit. Okay, I was like, oh, am I meant to go somewhere? No, there's no door. Okay, so I probably could have skipped. Uh, maybe not. Wait, I'm a stealther. What am I doing? I can stealth past all of these guys. Ah. Oh. Well, I've already started doing the bonus mission, and I'm nearly there to finish stage one, so I might as well start to kill them. Wait, where's my reinforcements? There you are! Thank you, you kill them, I'll kill these guys over here. Literally just pressing number two, because it's a very effective ability against AOE groups. Have they already... Oh, okay! My enforcements have uh, been killed. Well, thanks for nothing! And they've disappeared into thin air. Magic. I just realised as well, I can't scavenge these droids. Because I don't have scavenging. Oh no. That's a bugger. I think it's my uh my smuggler that has a scavenging. But look at my crew skills. I've got them up pretty high so far. Oh, I'm nearly level 34 as well. Exciting. What if I get to level 34 by killing this droid? Because I know killing elites gets me a lot of experience. About 2,000 or 3,000 something? No, I was wrong. 7,000. Okay. So if I were to kill... Actually, no! Yes, if I kill you... 
Uh, and then do this to the droids. I said do this to the droids. I was going to say, I thought they were going to be damaged, but no, I guess not. Well, I'm just going to kill you droids and then level up. There we go. Also, I like how the game freezes for like a split second just for, just to level up. We're like, hey, give me a second, I'm just catching up with you. It's like that person who's too late to say surprise at a birthday party. You know, they're just sort of ducked down and then everybody's all like, surprise, happy birthday. And then like 10 seconds later, this guy just pops up and is like, oh yeah, yeah happy birthday. Yeah. I have no idea why I said that. That was the most random thing I've probably ever said. Lovely, bye. I said bye, thank you. You're still alive? How dare you still be alive? Oh, in four minutes, I can finally use the major experience boost, which lasts for three hours. Hello, HXI54. Do I need to kill you again? Like, well, yeah, I need to kill you again. But I mean, for the achievement. What are we doing? Boarding party. Um, no, there's not many normal mode. It's in hard mode. I'd need to kill you about a billion times. And we're not doing hard mode. Wait. I've not done. What? Oh, that was in the time when all the achievements was bugged, wasn't it? Of course. Wait, why aren't we using Heroic Moment? Silly Charlie. Oh, it's this one. I hate this one. Oh, yeah, you gotta wait for. You gotta stay out of the lightning. Um. And not get hurt. Lovely. Now, don't you blow it all back out again, if I remember rightly? I'm probably. Yes! Yes, I was right. Sucks it in and then blows it all back out. And just make sure you're away from the lightning. Where's my Jesus droid? Has my Jesus droid died? Uh, I don't know because I can't see it at all. I th ah! I might actually be fighting without it. He must be. Oh, okay, he must be out. I guess my Jesus droid did die. Say goodbye to your life. Whatever life it is. Oh, 23,000 experience. Lovely. Come back, Jesus Droid. I don't know why you died. Or where you died. Or when you died. But welcome back. We've lost engineering, but their vanguard is headed for the bridge. Regroup and protect the command deck. Okay. Was that was that set to me? Captain Yoto. Oh, no. Yeah. Re regroup and get the command deck. Guys. Oh, wait. You're dying, so you can't do it. Mwah, mwah. While I've got your attention, do go and watch my top 5 things Kotet needs to do to keep players video, which took me 12 hours to make. Yeah, over 3 days. <sighs> it's a good video, it's, it's one of my most proudest videos I've ever made. Because of how well crafted it was made. You gotta, you gotta admit it, it was, it, was, it was beautifully made. Are there any more relays? I was gonna say, I haven't, I haven't encountered any relays in quite a while. There's one. And there's a Jedi that I need to kill anyway. Two Jedi I need to kill. Lovely. Hey, you're a Jedi Consular. Do you know Strander, Kranantoko's brother? You don't? Oh, well, I thought all Jedi Consulars knew each other. Just like apparently how every gay person knows each other. You know, that's, that's, what, that's what I hear. Even though it's not true. It's like, I'm human. Doesn't mean I know every human on the planet. Doesn't mean I know every gay as well! Reinforcements to deck 3, 7, and 12. We need more time to escape that tractor beam. Tough, because I'm going to bring in my own reinforcements that are going to die because they suck. What are you doing? Where are you running to? Okay, one engineer got scared and was all like, Ah, don't kill me! Oh, can I use my experience boost now? Yeah! There we go. Experience for the next three hours. Again, I probably could have just gone to my stronghold and grabbed one from my uh, stronghold cargo bay. But... Couldn't be bothered. Could you all come a bit closer, please? Could you all come a little bit closer? No? It'd be great if you could. Because that way, y you can all get in the way of my uh, lacerate. Uh, but I guess not. Wow, am I nearly level 35 already? Can't believe this. We'll be level 50 before we know it. By the way, where are my reinforcements? I asked for reinforcements a moment ago, but I got none. Unless they all died somewhere. Probably. Why am I even killing these ads? I don't need to. It's the Jedi Knights that I need. Oh, seriously, Charlie, you're just wasting your time now. Oh, hello. Are you another boss? Well, let me get my heroic moment out, drop it down first, and then I'll fight you. Okay. Oh, watch this pop through the door. 
you guys apparently. Well, I'm going to kill this droid first. Where more reinforcements come through that door. Lovely. And then I'll use... Uh, well, get out of my stun. And I'll use Lacerate to stop the Republic medics from healing the boss. I can't use Lacerate because I've been stunned again. Thank you very much. We hurry up and die. Thank you. And then there's these two. Whoever these two are. These two buggers. Flamethrower! Oh, you're dead. Oh, I was hoping I could use more of my uh, heroic moment than that, but I guess not. Guess I'll use it on whatever ads I see in the future. Hello, Jedi Knights! You are willing volunteers! I needed you for the bonus mission anyway. La 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 la. Oh, I can't stun the battle droid, but, 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 I can do the relay. Not the 100 meter relay, because that would just be a nightmare to do. I don't run. Hey, Jedi Knight, do you mind sort of, uh, coming over here? Just, just so that I can... Oh, oh no, actually! Yay! That's what I wanted to do! That was way more fun! Hurry up and kill this Republic Mando! Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! And in stealth! Lovely. Uh, two more Jedis here, and then I'll need two more Jedis up ahead. Somewhere. Oh god, am I going to be able to kill these two Jedis before this droid gets here? Something tells me, no. Although I'm level 35 now, so that's a plus. I don't know why, uh... Oh, come on. Don't be seen. Just, just walk around. Just walk around. Good droid. Well done. Lovely. This is Captain Yeldo to Master Donaire. We've identified the enemy vanguard. Intercept immediately. Actually, if you could not, that would be great. Oh, we finally reached the last part of this map. About time. Well, I'm going to kill these uh, Jedi's anyway. Because Jedi? Je Jedi. Jedi. Plural. Jedi is plural for Jedi. Yes. You know, Jedi Consular, you're meant to be the healer. And uh, you didn't do a very good job healing your fellow Jedi Knight. A terrible, terrible job. Okay. What's uh, round three of the bonus mission? Disable reactor security terminals. I'm guessing they're in the next area. Okay. Oh my god! Jesus! Don't scare me like that, droid. Uh, heroic moment? Yes, please. Jedi healer, Jedi healer. I need to take those out first. You will not pass. I am Jedi and I will stop you. No, you won't. Especially when you don't have your healers anymore. Me and a hundred more will come for you. No, they won't. You were the most annoying boss out of this flashpoint because you kept going on and on and on. How about stuff that would never... a hundred more will come for you. Just shut up. Seriously, just shut up. You will do... You will shut up permanently in about... Three seconds. There is no death, wow. Only the force. That was three seconds exactly. How about that? Is this the terminal I need? Not for the bonus mission, for the main mission though. This is Captain Yelto to the Imperial boarding party. I admit, you have us outnumbered and outgunned. You know we're not going to escape. You were doomed the moment we found you. Possibly, but I've still got one option. This vessel is powered by a Type 4 Hypermatter Annihilator. Right now, I'm disabling the safeties and rigging it to self-destruct. Scary. In a few minutes, you, me, my ship, and half your fleet will be reduced to stardust. Uh... Bad mistake. Lady, consider yourself a former member of the living. Why is this in the way as well? Like who like who puts an emergency culto station in the way of a terminal? At least put it there. Don't put it there. My word. La 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 Everything's self-destructing. Oh no, don't see me droid if you could. Thank you. Are there any more terminals? No, there is not. Now I can just skip past all of you guys. Bye bye! I'm going to Mathenia. stun you. A spike in power levels. You need to get to the bridge. I'm getting there. Give me a chance. I already know what's happening. Ah, I remember this. You could literally just skip this entire boss if you wanted to. Because you could just go up here. Ha 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 ha. But I need to actually disable the terminal. Um, if I stun you a minute, just to be on the safe side... Uh, and... Uh-oh. Again. They, uh... Really didn't last very long. 
Not at all. Has the Jesus droid died again? Are you actually having a laugh, Jesus droid? Why do you keep dying? It's like the Jesus droid didn't die once when I was doing the flashpoints on the smuggler. And like all of a sudden, oh, I can't handle the Empire side. And again, we do just do everything by brute force. So, cool. Get the back out here. Get the back out here? Yes. Get out here and show me your back, droid. I was basically trying to swear without actually swearing. That's probably why I said back. Because I wanted to say the F word, but... You know me, I tried to be as uh, child-friendly as I possibly could. Which we all know is a load of balls, because, well, uh... I say things which, uh... Children still shouldn't hear. Bonus mission objective updating. Shut down the reactor. Where's the reactor? Oh! I'm going the wrong way. I need to go this way. Ooh, secret stuff. Hello, bonus boss. Don't mind me. I'm just going to get out my heroic moment, drop it on you, and then kill you. Right, I always forget what I need to do with this boss. So I need to kill these two droids first. I imagine so. Um... I mean, this guy is nearly... I say this guy. This droid is nearly dead, so I might as well kill this droid first. Oh, God, I'm nearly dead. I'm nearly dead. I'm nearly dead. I'm nearly dead. Nearly dead. Heal myself up. Oh. You heal me, droid, once I've already healed myself up. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh. Okay. The boss died? What? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Fine. The boss got killed by its own droid. Fine then. That, I, I'm, I'm okay with that, I guess. I still need one more comlink relay. I could really do with it right now. Ah, oh, there it is, right up there. Lovely. Excuse me for one moment. I'm just going to stun. Actually, no. Hello, sneaky person. I'm going to stun you. And then do this. Oh, I was seen anyway. Well, okay then. But guess what? Force cloak! Oh. Screw you! And then, of course, there's you. Still cowering in fear, I see. You should be. We are the Sith. Hold non-essential fleet vessels with Jura. The Republic ship is preparing to self-destruct. Not unless I can stop it from happening. You have no faith in me, seriously. Look at you all ready to protect the area. Well, tough. Ooh. What's these? Can I get through? This door is locked. What about this one? This one has like a little bit of a lip to it. Oh. What's the point then? Why do you do that? Oh well. Oh god, not this one. Oh, this one. Right, which one do I kill first? Uh... I think it's you because he can't really be hurt because I think if I remember that rightly he can't really be hurt because he's connected to you so until he dies he won't stop being connected to him and you can't hit him until he dies if I remember that rightly I'm probably not but you know and I also have no heroic moment as well oh and you're the okay now I, okay yeah so you're the medical officer so I need to kill you first because you're going to keep healing him. Um, and of course, I can't hit him until I've killed him. Yes, right. See? I'm not all hopeless. I still remember some tactics in boss fights. I mean, I'm mostly hopeless, but not... We're taking you with us. Not all the time. And no, you're not. You are most certainly not. You're going down first. Med Was it you who said that, Alon? No. Commander Jorland. All right. Well... Elon, you're dead anyway. Bye! Okay, uh, now it needs to be you, Chief Massey. Oh, I can get my heroic moment out now. Lovely. Drop that, because why not? Oh, wait, he can be her! Oh, well, can... well then, I am useless. Okay. I don't remember boss fights. Well, I thought I did. I thought that was the case. But... Screw me, right? Oh, hello! Captain Yelto. You thought you'd be successful, but no. Area is 
is secure. Get the tech team. Shut down the self-destruct. Blast you. All of you, get off my bridge! You know what? I think we're actually go. To you? Using a fleet to capture one ship? You, soldier, make her silent. On it. Oh! What about the rest of the crew? Should I tell the boarding parties to begin executions? But of course! Kill them all. Fear will ensure the Empire's strength. Acknowledged. Ah! Oh my god, they actually all had! Bloody work, but necessary. When the operation is complete, we'll broadcast the names and faces of the dead as a warning to the galaxy. More importantly, the cruiser is ours. Preparing it for the assault on the foundry and its Jedi master now. I'm just going to point out, I know when you said bloody work, you're just referring to, you know, it's messy work and all of that. But it almost sounded like you were going, bloody work! Uh... Why the hesitation? We need to make a few repairs and get a crew in place, but we'll be ready shortly. In the meantime, I offer congratulations and suggest you return to the flagship. Darth Malgus wants to speak to his strike force. Does he now? Well, okay, and I'll take all of that. Thank you. Oh, so close to level 36. So bloody close. And now I've done the boarding party thing of the achievement. We've only got to do another 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 more to do! Yay! Anyway, let's go speak to Fenir. Moff Fenir, you said Malgus wanted to talk. Yes, while we're refitting the Republic cruiser. You have done well, all of you. Had we such strength in the last war, the Treaty of Coruscant might not have been needed. We're honored, my lord. But now, a greater challenge awaits. I have studied the information from the Republic vessel, and I am now certain of the Foundry's nature. How did you discover this? I know the history of war, and three times, space stations matching the Foundry specifications have changed the course of nations. Each of these legendary stations could manufacture technology on a massive scale. One Xenoformed planets, another built fleets of ships. The Starforges? The Foundry creates endless armies of droids, commanded by the Foundry's Jedi Master. A man very likely mad after his long imprisonments. No good can come of this. Moff you may proceed. The Foundry is built into an asteroid surrounded by the Republic fleet. The cruiser we captured should pass their blockade without interference. You will fly the cruiser directly to the Foundry and lead the ground assault, while our ships jump from hyperspace to engage the fleet. The Foundry will be ours, and you will eliminate the Jedi Master. Is there a reason you can't do this? Much as I would like to handle this personally, other matters require my attention. Wonder what they are. It isn't just the Foundry we fight for. We fight to prove to the galaxy that the Empire is unstoppable. Glory to the Sith and to the Emperor. Okay, and now we've got to do the Foundry, which we will, of course, Karanko. I honestly thought that was trying to reference Kranatoka then for some strange reason, but not everything in this game is about me. <laughs> so next time we've got to do the Foundry, which I think is one of the best flashpoints in the game, I'll actually admit. And you'll see why in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen, and I shall see you next time, and a farewell to you.